guys, how are we? So today I thought I'd share with you just three really fast, easy hairstyles that, um, they're my go-to hairstyles that help me get out the door, you know, within five, ten minutes. So I hope they help you and I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Okay, so currently looking like a hot mess. Very nice. Um, so nothing gets you out the front door faster than a nice sleek ponytail. Sleek ponytails can look quite sexy and I've seen quite a few models um, rocking them at the moment with the um, straight hair. So I'll show you how I do mine. So firstly, I'm just going to brush it. Now I actually rarely brush my hair um, just because it goes really frizzy and not only that, also my hair breaks very easy so I've got to be careful. So I just have a nice little red hair tie. Okay. I'm very lucky. Um, my hair doesn't get oily, which is great. It just gets dirty, I suppose. Um, so I don't have to wash it too often, which is good because of my red, so it doesn't fade as fast. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm just going to brush it all the way. Ugh up into a pony. Um, I only have to wash my hair probably every three, four days even I can get away. It depends if I exercise a lot. If I exercise a lot obviously I need to wash it more because that's a bit gross otherwise. But um, other than that I just use some dry shampoo. The only thing about dry shampoo and red hair is that it can make it look quite dull. Um, <clears throat> So I don't really like that. So that's okay. Alright. So I always try and use a hair tie the same colour as my hair. I feel that a ponytail at this height looks the best on me. Flashes my face the most. So nice and tight there. And because my hair's quite fine, I have had a lot of hair loss. I just like to take one of these, which is a teasing brush. Sorry, it's got my hair all in it. And I just take half my ponytail, section it like that. And then I just leave that bottom bit, section this top bit again. And I just tease down the base, it's just to give myself a fuller looking pony. And then just turn the um, brush like that and don't put any weight on it. Just let it skim the top just to comb down those little uh, teasy bits that you can see. Because you don't want to look like a bird's nest. Alright, so now I've got a fuller looking ponytail. Now just a little trick to get rid of the little baby hairs there, which I'm very blessed to have bit of hairspray on your little brush just a little bit that's only a medium hold hairspray this is the fudge skyscraper and it smells like apple and coconut it smells really good same thing not much weight and just sort of brush it back Okay, so how simple is that? Two seconds, really? If I wasn't talking, it would have been faster. But um, that's just how, if I just really need to get out the door, that's just how I like to chop my hair up in a ponytail. But it can look quite nice. Sometimes I might put like a little um, flower or, or some kind of diamantes or something like that. Or even a cute little headband. So that's how I do my ponytail. So on to the second one. Alright, so a way to curl your hair super fast when you're in a rush. So, firstly you need two lackeys. They don't have to be the same colour. Then, we're just going to part our hair down the middle. We'll part your hair however you want down the front. I like to have a side part. And then we're just going to do two piggy tails. This is really fast. This is pretty much how I curl my hair all the time. <laughs> Why spend ages, hey? Oh, Pippi long stockings, eat your heart out. 
Okay, so take your trusty um, iron or curling wand. Now, don't forget, make sure you're using your heat protector spray. I've already put all that in my hair. So you're just going to take your little sections. Now, this is just going to be a very loose curl. Take your little sections and just really roughly curl each section. This is so simple. Just gives more of a textured, textured sort of look. I love messy curls. I think there's nothing um, more sexy than that sort of bed hair messy curl look. Pretty much this takes five minutes, which is awesome. Sorry, I'm looking down still. I just need the mirror. In the viewfinder, I can't see bits like that. <laughs> I always prefer to use irons rather than um, a curling one. I'm not too fast on the curling ones. I have heaps of them, but I do love these irons for a, a curl. Now I feel like Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. I don't hate it. <laughs> okay, so now just take out your um, pigtails. And then I just like to comb through with my fingers, just sort of fluff it up a little bit. And then all I do is just take this top little section and just do a few little curls there, just to make it all blend in nicely. And then I just re sort of fluff the top, run my fingers through it. Just make sure it all blends. And there you are. Like five minute curls. Everyone always says to me, oh, it must take so long. And I'm like, yeah, five minutes. <laughs> so this is the second look so fast. Like it didn't even take five minutes, hasn't even been recording for five minutes. So yeah. That's the second way to do it. So I hope this one helps you guys out a little bit. So on to the third hairstyle. Okay, so for this hairstyle, um, I kind of got a little bit of inspiration from Jennifer Lopez and Rihanna, and actually pretty much every star at the moment. They're all doing the half up, half um, down thing. So why not give it a go? This is really cute. Well, I think it's cute. It makes you look a little bit young, but who cares? All right, so just take your trusty little brush. Pretty much, you can do it straight or curly. Um, I prefer, I like it straight on some, some girls. On me personally, I like it curly. I, I don't know. Just, I think I've got a funny shaped head, so the curly suits me better. All right, so I'm just using my little teasing brush again. And just smoothing. You can do this more textured, um, but I like it nice and smooth at the front. Oh. <sighs> okay, so I'm going to take my little curling iron. I'm just going to fix up some of these curls because they're just going to show through. I like this hair 
style for, um, just say you're going out, okay, for instance, when I go shooting with my hubby at the shooting gallery, you have to wear earmuffs. And I like to wear my hair down if we're going on a little bit of a date. So then putting your earmuffs on, it's all sticking to your face. It's not a good sort of thing. So this is good because it keeps the hair out of the way. All right. So I need to put these down without burning something on my legs. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do the same thing I did with my ponytail because I like a little bit of height. Oh, so firstly, actually, clip the whole thing out of the way. And then take that section that's the hair that's all down, take a little section, about an inch, and just tease it at the roots. Now don't worry about being perfect. Okay, that's just going to help it all blend in. Okay, so now I'll do the same thing. And <clears throat> just go half again. And we're just going to curl more sort of the side bits here. Oh, sorry, you can't see me. So these are from the ponytail. This is really fast as well. My hair's not super, super fine. Um, but it's finer than what it used to be. Okay, so now that we just killed that again, take your half pony again. I'm sorry, I can't see. Oh dear. Okay, and this time we're going to tease both sections before we only tease the top one, but this time we're going to tease both. So just hold it tight, taking my trusty little brush. You can use a comb, I prefer to use the brushes. Just tease that. And we'll just take the top section, don't go too heavy because it'd be too hard to um, smooth out afterwards. Alright. So then just do the not much weight with it and just smooth down the very top. It. And then if you get little flyaways like that, that's okay. Same thing. Bit of hairspray. Hairspray fixes everything. Alright. Cool. So pretty much that is it. And then you just sort of fluff it up and comb it out with your hands and do whatever you need to do sometimes because um, my hair is long. I do like to just take these little sections just behind the ears just to blend in that top curl a little bit more with the bottom curl. See how it looks more flowy. And that's it, hairstyle number three. So, I, yeah, it's nice and easy. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope maybe it helps you get out the door a little bit faster and shows you how to curl it just really easy. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. Bye.